I submit you gladly, but let us embrace our culture too. It is clear that our sponsors and partners have identified that supporting a cultural value system is key to ensuring that culture continues, culture continues to thrive and in turn, knowledge can be passed on through intergenerations without fading away. Culture is a fundamental aspect of our heart. Whether we like it or not, it provides a sense of belonging every individual. It provides the views of the people and a reflection of the community or nation. Moreover, I strongly say partners that we need to have a unified nation in order for all of us here, whether we know or not, to have the ability to progressively develop our country down here. At no point, sir, in time should our country be subjected to tribal insinuations and divisions. It is not in order, and it should not be, and it never shall be, it shall never be tolerated by any national leadership, traditional leadership, or even the public. It remains an acceptable self. We are one South Yon, one nation. Let words pronounce translate into corresponding actions and not vice versa. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, our province also accommodates various touristic sites to mother over. You are all urged to explore these sites, including the wide sand beaches of Sanjia, Umangwe Falls, Munduruma Falls, Lake Mwebu, Ntumbachushi Falls, among its others. Please, take time to enjoy these sites so that we can advance the province in the right manner without reliance. I am grateful and truly honored and I do express my sincere gratitude to all the sponsors and partners who I would like to individually mention. The Bezusi, our main sponsor, we thank you. Zanako, our lead sponsor, we thank you. Atlas Mara, our sponsor, who went further to grant a plan from ProFlight, the plan that flew over the Southern Africa, the matter like in all these countries. We thank you very much together with ProFlight. Sponsors and partners in the Big Corridor are 991 Security, Access Card, Africa Invitations, Aqua Kena Water, Bonanza Golf Course, Chester Flower House, Cheetah Lodges and Resort, Sierra Resort and Spa, Colossal Industries Limited, Diamond TV, Discover Insurance, Gilbert, Energy Recreation Board, FAS, Azida Motors, Indo Zambibar, International School of Lusaka, Lama Search International, The Selfa Hydro Power Company, Mark II, Madsen, Ninja 365, the Gambo Golf View Hotel, Mawamuina Adventures, Asamungwe TV, Madsen, Pesca Energy, Famanelba, Ratsa, Shopra, Exclusion and Technology Information, Vangenza, Luton, South Africa, wonderful group of companies, Yako Foundation, Zambia Air Services Training Institute, Zambia Army, Zambia Post Corporation, Zambia Medical Regulatory Authority, Zambia National Service, Zambia Sugar, Zambia Tourism Agents, Zambia Brewers, Zambia National Green Society, and the It is hoped that I have a committed any institution. Furthermore, our media fraternity and critical partner, thank you for having partnered with us. Steve, from inception of the launch of the yeah, 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 yeah,
I thank you, I wish you safe travels around the world. Thank you so much. The various recreation sites of Mother. Project 2019, point number two, and in the center. God bless you. God bless Zambia. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Again, just to go begging your indulgence, I would have invited a group to entertain us, but time is not our ally. Let me run into the protocols very quickly and invite the provincial permanent secretary, Mr. Mike Kumba, to please run us through the protocols and call the guests to go on and to deliver his speech. Sir. Let me thank you most sincerely 
and the organizers of this colorful and memorable event, which offers not only the rich cultural values of the Lunda people, but also provides the display, the showcase for tourism involvement in our great nation, Zambia. Ladies and gentlemen, the Royal Highnesses, the Mutomboko ceremony is one of the most prestigious traditional ceremonies in our country. The ceremony signifies a conquest, grants and symbolizes the victories of the Lunda people recorded when they crossed the Luapula River into Zambia, fighting their way through the conquering of various tribes on their way from Kola in the modern day Democratic Republic of the Congo. This year's ceremony is particularly special because we are also celebrating the Silver Jubilee of your Highness, your Royal Highness, to the Mata Kazembe throne 25 years ago. This, as a matter of fact, your Royal Highness, it does coincide with the year that I personally met you in person to confirm I've known you at first hand level for 25 years. So I feel very, very honored. Your Royal Highness, ladies and gentlemen, the traditional ceremony such as this one plays a very important role not only in the lives of the Lunda people, but the entire country, Zambia at large, including the neighboring countries. They create a sense of identity, nationalism, and presentation of the country's cultural, rich cultural heritage. Furthermore, the Royal Highness Distinguished Guests, traditional ceremonies have the potential to promote tourism and bring a boost to individual and household income. As the saying goes, your Royal Highness, a people that is void of a culture, a heritage, is like a tree that has got no roots. It is there for a parity that this very important ceremony is passed on to the future generations that are coming after ourselves. Our government has made priority, your Royal Highness, to tourism and has identified it as one of the key economic sectors with great potential to diversify the economy and create jobs. Therefore, we will continue to support all the traditional ceremonies as a cultural component of tourism and also uh, economic value. Your Royal Highness, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, our government does acknowledge the traditional ceremonies also and most importantly, as a unifying factor, as they provide a vital platform for government to attend to the traditional leaders and to interface and share ideas of our various diverse cultural belongings. As you can see today, we have Mugwenyama, we have Mugwenyama Masmawe, we also have uh, Chief Magodi, if I'm not mistaken, from the Eastern Province, who have come to enjoy the felicitation of the Mugwenyama ceremony here in Masawangwe, our home. Your Royal Highness, the UP and the New York government has given its reaffirmation and its commitment to the continued encouraging of these traditional ceremonies. And to the traditional leaders, we give encouragement to continue celebrating these ceremonies as a way of preserving our national and country identity. Very well, Highness, our government is committed to the delivery of development and ensuring that no area is left behind as evidenced by the government's policy of the significant increase 
of the constituency development plan, allocation and introduction of another flagship program of free education policy, among others. Enhanced constituency development fund provides an opportunity to make service delivery more responsive to the public needs as a local people to have the opportunity to decide on their own what kind of development they would like to see. Further, Your Royal Highness, government is committed to the development of Mansarovo district and this commitment can be seen through the various projects currently being undertaken here in Mansarovo district. I am extremely proud to mention that the construction of Mansarovo district hospital which commenced in the year 2021 is at 90% done. We are very proud to record such. I would like to confirm to you, Your Royal Highness, that this project is going to be handed over by the contractor to the government by September this year, which is barely just two months from now, when the remaining works are completed. This is the kind of development that we want to bring to our people. Your Royal Highness, we know that you are an ambassador against child marriages. And child marriages are a major challenge in our country, Zambia, as well as an obstacle to education of the girl child. The UPAD New Girl Government has introduced free education and it is implementing the re-entry policy to ensure that every child goes to school and is educated. In addition to that, the government has also provided funds through the Constituency Development Fund for secondary schools and skills training bursaries. This initiative, the Royal Highness, is there in order to make sure that we carry forward even those children who may have skipped out of school in the past to come back in life. I am particularly pleased today when I saw on the schedule of the program an award-giving portion or segment for excellency in your schools around your, your chief dog, your excellence. This goes to show that we are on the same hip page, we are on the same hip sheet, as we appreciate what education can do to those who are less privileged and cannot afford to go to school from the household income. We will continue to work with you. We would like to urge you to continue holding our hands as we provide this very valuable valuable, value-adding matter to our citizens so that and when we look back after our time has come, we will say that we managed to give an equalizer to our children who ordinarily would not have their parents affording to take them to school. We thank you for your forthrightness in partnering with government to make sure that children attain an education. Your Royal Highness, Mata Gazette, as I conclude, I would like to thank everyone, beginning with those who sponsored this prestigious ceremony, and onward down to we who have just merely come to attend this ceremony. You form a very important part of the success of this ceremony because you are here to witness this momentous occasion. I will be failing your Royal Highness in my duty if I don't give response to some of the lamentations that those who spoke on your behalf shared with us on this same platform and that is the state of the roads in the province. The Road Development Agency are on the ground and in responding to the terrible nature of our road, I want to confirm to you, Your Royal Highness, that the Minister of Finance 
has allocated money to the Road Development Agency to patch up the Cheme to Chilenge Road, the Mansa to Sambia, Honwa to Tuta Bridge on the north end, in order to make motorability of vehicles a little bit more comfortable. The RDA, the Royal Highness, has also budgeted for 400 kilometers of rural roads that are going to be done by the Zambia National Service. I would also be failing to state that the Royal Highness, the President of the Republic of Zambia, Mr. Hagaile Ishtema, has managed to do something that is already in public domain now, in public knowledge, and that is to restructure the debt that we inherited from those who came before us, which is providing slight more room to deal with other social programs, including infrastructure development. At this juncture, Your Royal Highness, I'd like to thank you most profusely, most sincerely, for creating this platform for me, for shining the light on me to be here with you, and wish you God's blessing. And thank you all for your kind attention. May God bless you and may God keep, keep you. Thank you very much. That was a speech by the guest of honor. Ladies and gentlemen, I know him to be one of the most accomplished and articulate speakers so far. And you know, in my experience, I wasn't born yesterday. So it's of him to chapter Shasam. I will again invite the guest of honor so that he leads the people that are going to pay tributes now to Mother in form of presents. Please. The guest of honor, sir. My name is Taya Kutula, my presence. I'm a Latin Pilapon, you are guest of honor. Hello, I'm a head of the government department in the province. My name is Nama Cabinet Minister Zabeshire, members of parliament present. My name is Kuti Bakum Kano, we are guest of honor. We are a Nama Sensei.
claro, eso es ni como a la tapada, raspando. Para el Instituto África, para el Instituto África, no van a tratar eso. A todo el mundo, a todo el mundo, no te puedo atitar que pensamos a todo el mundo.